Okay, we are live. It is freezing down here in this room right now. I have a I have a blanket. <laughs> it's been very cold the last couple of days, and um, I haven't been down in my office today at all. I usually like to warm it up a little bit first, but not today. So I have my little space heater going. And I'm just going to cuddle up in this <laughs> nice, comfy little blanket I have. This little emergency blanket I have on standby down here. All right. Oh, how's everybody doing? Come on in. Hello. Hi, everyone. We're going to play some Baldur's Gate 3 tonight. Yeah. Hello. The Bark Urge is back. Hey, Teching, just got the lung transplant list. Oh, just got on the lung transplant list. This is my first time watching these live streams. Well, welcome, and I'm glad you got on the list. Hope that gets resolved quickly. Ugh. Uh, my cat is curled up next to me because it's a little too cold. Yeah, I don't have a cat. I just have a blanket and a space heater next to me, but it is... It is 61 degrees down here in my basement right now. Yeah. Uh, will there be spoilers beyond where you're up to? I mean, yeah, probably I'm going to mention stuff at any point in the game. Yeah. Wait, what is Baldur's Gate? Um, I honestly couldn't tell you. I don't know. I think it's some, uh, I think it's like a rock. It's, it's a boulder. It's a boulder named Gate. There it goes. Uh, Jamal, hey, Tekking, thanks. I recently moved out, and this is my first time watching your stream for my new apartment. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool, dude. I remember, like, when I moved out and uh, living in my new house, uh, like, like I, I, like, watched, like, the same YouTube channels I, o I always did, but, like, just living in my new house was, like, a really nice experience. I remember the first thing I did when I moved in because when I moved into my house, I'm obviously really kind of, like, I have a lot of anxiety over that because I'm, like, moving for the first time and, like, moving stuff from one house to another. So there's a lot of a lot of running around, a lot of being busy. And I remember, like, the first night at my new house, I, uh, I had a panic attack because I was trying to do everything at once. I was trying to unpack everything. And, um, like, the first couple of days living here, like, first three or four days, I'm just unpacking stuff and trying to get my life back in order. And, uh... I decided, like, I had the complete set of uh, Buffy the Vampire Slayer that I had bought from, like, a flea market a few months prior to this. And I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to sit down and I'm just going to start watching the whole series. And that's what I did for, like, the first couple of months I lived here. <laughs> it, it was a nice... It, it grounded me in a big way. Yeah, so I, I get the mood. All right. So I will warm up as we go. All right. So last time, uh, we... What did we do last time? Uh, we were at the Grove. We figured out Korga has a secret meeting down by the docks. Uh, somebody has that letter. Uh, wait, what the hell is this? An open letter on oppression and peacocks. What? What is this now? Written in a... When did I pick this up? Written in a furious, slo slopping, sloping hand. This letter to the editor of Baldur's Bash. Dear editor, I find it despicable. Nay, Diabolical, sir, that you would defend Baldur's Gate ridiculous restrictions regarding animals in the city. No animal larger than a peacock may gain entry. How archaic. My darling Giselle. Ooh, it's Giselle Gwell. My darling Giselle is the most well-behaved bear you'll ever meet. And yet to spend time with my child, I must visit my summer home in Cormier. I call upon the Parliament of Peers to resolve this issue forthwith. Immediately, the emotional and psychological well-being of the people of Baldur's Gate is at stake, sir. And I shall take this to the highest of authorities. This dude is a total Karen. This dude is a Karen before a Karen. Right now, Giselle cries out for her father. This archaic policy has separated a child from their parent. I don't know how Grand Duke Ulda Ravengard lives with himself. Yours faithfully, Mr. R. Pickens. All right. I, I support this man. I support this man and his right to have a bear. I, I As soon as I get back to Baldur's Gate, I am going to start a, a protest against the Parliament of Peers. Authority! All right. Well, that was that. Uh, 
But where was the other package? Where was the letter that was like the more important letter? This thing? Oh, did that open a quest? Did we start a quest by- wait, wait. You can start quests by reading papers? If I would have known that, I would have read more papers. This is the contract we got from uh, that guy that we punched. Uh, yeah. Got Lethala's loot. Uh, I will give that to our bard. Our our resident bard, Alfira 2. Uh, yeah. But anyway, we, we did that with Korga, and then we picked up Karlak. We got Karlak last time. Yeah. So, we're pretty beat up. So we're going to take a long rest, but first I'm going to talk to some people in camp here. I'll be honest, soldier. I'm reeling. Will hardly knows me, but he chose my life over his. It's because he's a stand-up fella, Carlac. It's been a long time since someone stuck their neck out for me like that. You can say that again. When Very well. Me, I shall burns, say that again. I thought he was just another sad merc. How wrong I was. Well, that was nice. What path lies before me? All right. And Will has some stuff to say, well probably about sprouting it. horns. He probably has a thing God or two to say about that. Straight back to the hells. Just look at me. I did what was right. I mean, Mazora made me. I mean, Will. Let's be honest here. It could have been a lot worse. Demons, she said. Traitors and hypocrites, heartless evils of all sorts, but not, not Zariel's victims, not innocent tieflings. I mean, oh, I failed an Arcana check. But, like, I mean, Will, it could have been a lot better. You could have gotten, like, a badass pair of wings. Uh, but it also could have been a lot worse. You could have been turned into, like, a main. You know, there are these main things that live in the abyss, and they're basically, they're demons, not devils. But, like, there are these basically, like, sludge demons that are just like, blah, blah. And then there's the, there's an equivalent in the devils, in the hells. There's these, like, the lowest cast of devil are basically just this sludge devil, you know? So you could have got turned into one of those. It could have been a lot worse. Yeah. All these years. You'd think it's a lesson I'd have well learned. It's Mazora who grants me the power to conjure armor and cast Eldritch Blasts. Yes, and you conjure them well. Infected. I could even call hell beasts and summon festering clouds, but... I promise you, every thrust of oh. my blade and every flame I sparked was for the good of the coast. Nice. So, there, yeah, that's something that I actually didn't know the first time I played this game. Uh, but we're all supposed to be, like, way higher level. Like, Gale is supposed to be, like, a master wizard. And Karlak, you know, fought in Zariel's army down in the Blood War in Avernus. You know what I mean? So, obviously, like, she's, like, level 3 right now. Obviously, she would have been, like, level, like, 15 or some shit, you know, before. Um, but after getting infected with the tadpoles, I guess that resets you to level 1. Which, you know, I don't like that trope. But I'm okay if the game starts with it, rather than, like, imagine if the game started, like, in One Piece Odyssey, where it gives you all the cool attacks, and then, like, you forgot everything, sorry, you're back to level one now. I'm like, ah, screw you. Yes. I can't utter the terms or circumstances of the pact. Can you do an interpretive dance? Else, but the pact, I'm forbidden, unless Mazora permits it. But I'll say this. Can you mime the, the pact? I pacted myself to Mazora, I have not regretted for a heartbeat. Can you Morse code the pact? It was worth the sacrifice. If I read your All mind, can, give you on that. can I understand the pact? Word. Yeah. Ah, uh, every Metroid game. Oh, yeah. Dude, I especially hate it whenever there's a sequel to a game, right? Like... You know, and it's like at the end of the first game, you're straight up a god and you've leveled up to max and you've defeated like, I am Helgar, the the lord ruler of this eldritch realm. And you have to be like level 50 to kill him. And he's like, no, you have defeated me, Helgar. You are now on the level of a deity. And then like the sequel of the game picks up and it's like, yeah, well, you know, it's been a couple years since we fought. We're a little rusty. So uh, we kind of forgot all that, all that god magic. <laughs> We're going to have to work hard to get back to where we were. <laughs> oh, God, I love that. That happened in Steven Universe. I loved how at the end of Steven Universe, like, they're all super strong, and then there's the movie, and they all get their ass kicked, and then they're like, yeah, sorry, I'm a little rusty. We haven't fought in a couple years, so that means we forgot pretty much how to fight at all. 
And I'm like, oh, yeah. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Sure, okay. <laughs> oh, man, apparently this is a, a common trope in Metroid, God of War, and The Witcher games, apparently. All right, anybody else we're talking to here? How about Scratch? Let's talk to him. He's a good boy. S Hope you're keeping well. Scratch, get down from that trunk, that tree. I don't want you to fall in the water. I care about you, Scratch. I swear, oh god, that that is terrifying. I have done my duty as a tree. I love that look of like, I have done so. I have pet a dog. My task for the day is complete. All right, I think it's time I go to bed. We got to get some health back. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Anybody else in camp want to talk to me? How about Shadowheart? We forgot to, we forgot to romance Shadowheart. We got we to gotta see if there's any updates with her. Let's see what's going on here. Shah's blessings upon you. And you as well. And the great tree god Arboris upon you. There's no story. I think this is all the stuff None we had before. All right, that's fine. That's cool. Just every night, got to talk to Shadowheart. I love how the gore pile from Alvira 1 is still there. All right. Astarian, I told you I left you at camp today so you could clean that up. Come on, Astarian. What's up? Man, I am going to have a, a stern talking to behind you. Oh, okay. From your head. I didn't kill anyone. What she looked like as she died. Alvira's right over there. I didn't kill her. Skewered in abject agony. Oh, man. Did we kill Alvira too? No, she's right there. You would have given anything to have seen it. As you jolt awake, too many questions plague you. Okay. I love how even with my horn, it kind of looks like a cow lick a little bit. Like, oh, man, I have to comb my my horn. When the proud deed of her death was yours, why do you have no recollection of it? Uh, what, what? Oh, boy. Oh, where's this going? Okay. Me lord, jubilant day. I have found your vile self at last. Oh, my God, what's wrong with his face? Scaleritas fell. Fell. Ah, oh, like the tree, Your yes. And ever adoring butler. Of course, I sir. Told you, my dear rotted master. We have been parted so tragically long. Alright, so the story here is he is a rotted tree. Let's just go with that. Ah, oh, yes. S uh, Scolaritus fell, yes, of course. Um. Yeah. My lordly reprobate. I I missed you ever so. Uh, indeed. Fetch me my fertilizer at once, Fell. Following the stench of that bard. <sighs> I don't think Alfira would be she like that. Across the coast, like a piece of dog mark on the road. Such fine work. Oh wait, hold. Up, sorry. I have to let me move something around here. I know the sound cut off for a second. There it goes. Anyway, trying to get part of your dreadful in. Okay. I'm confused yet intrigued. You earned this iniquitous prize through your great show of exceptional violence the other night. Wait, so when I kill people, I'm I get sure free shit? Will be better soon. A fellow of your. Fine breeding is never down for long. <laughs> uh, I love this guy's hat. Can I steal this guy's hat? It's like a snake skeleton. Uh, there will be no barbarity. I will not kill again. Death wants everything to do with you, good villain. Be true to yourself, my lord. All right, then. I shall be true to the tree within. Yeah, I love how... Yeah, some people told me that last time. You know, if you wanted to save Alfir, you gotta knock her out first. I'm like, well, a lot of help that does me now. It doesn't matter. Alfir is fine. She's right here. Yes, she's climbing on crates. Yes, just like old Alfir used to. All right. Everybody healed up. Who do we got in our party? We got Karlak, Will. 
I would like to level up to... I think we're still level 3. We gotta level up to level 4 soon. I want to do that before we go deal with um, the hag. And I think I know exactly how to do so. Yeah. Yeah, Afira's been hitting the gym. Oh, yeah, she's she's jacked. Yeah, she's she's ready to fight. Yeah, look at those arms. Yeah, we're going to get her a good bard outfit whenever uh, we find one laying around. Um, all right. Now, what's that? If everyone else minds their business, oh, there's the hiding button. Ooh. Toggle group hive. That's ship C. Oh, it actually says so over here. That's nice to know. And that groups everybody. And then this is everybody's... Uh, okay, okay. This this is a great feature. I'm so glad this exists. Oh, there's a chest that Shadowheart has. Okay. Hold up. All right. I don't, I don't know why I'm hiding now. I want to get out of here. Uh, can I... Can I stop hiding, please? <laughs> I love how it was spotted by Withers in a clearly lit area. There it is. We have here? I've got a long road ahead. Play the loot. We shall play. Old time battles, the power, and bard dance. Let's play the power. Ah, yes. Twas like nothing was ever different. Lovely. Lovely. I can't waste any more time. Why am I hiding? Get out of hiding. <laughs> it won't let me leave hiding. I have to keep going. <laughs> Toggle group hide. Yeah. Or is it I don't know. The bard is looking so healthy. Yes, of course. I think it's a different button for group hide and then... Wait, is it Alt-C? There it is. It's Alt-C for that. Okay. There we go. All right. Now. What's in this chest? Can I not? Okay. have to keep going. Okay. Nothing. Congratulations. There was nothing in the chest. All right. All right that's Shadow Art. Gail. I still haven't used... La I have to add Lazel to my party. Uh, who's... Okay, where are we going next? Uh, we're going back to the Blighted Village. We could go in the Spider Cave. Spider Cave might be fun. In which case, I am going to add her to my party. Uh, okay. All right, I think we're going to go rocking in with Alfira, Lazel, and Karlak. Yeah, let's just do that. I'm gonna go through some of these options here. Yet we still collect more. Infinities upon infinities. So the goal today is anti ethel. Yeah, the goal today is anti ethel. Ceramorphosis takes all of you. Trying to get there. Oh, yeah. Let's talk about let's talk about that. There's no shame in a capricious murder now and again. Yeah, I love Lazel. And you waste energy and dull your weapon. Okay, so what's the magic number? Like four people? Well, what's the upper limit for how many people should I kill per day, Lazel? How what's the healthy amount of kills per day? I'm sure we can find you a goblin. I knew you would understand, Lazel. I knew you would understand. Alright, hold on, let me the Blade of Frontiers at your calling. Yeah. Oh man, I gotta go through all these options, don't I? All right. <laughs> we just gonna, a lot from we're Refusing. just gonna go. We're just gonna go through these real quick. But the devil won't take just. I care about you, Will. I do, I but found, I don't remember much of the battle. Pra angry, angry. The Frontiers <laughs> demanded a blade, and, and it's nice to meet someone of your talents. Having a worm wriggling in my skull didn't instill much confidence with you as my ally. It said that anyone who bathes in the river of blood emerges as one born in... I feel the weight of these... Not to yes, me, I get it. You got horns. Know. It's sad. What do you see? All right. Oh, oh, I remember this one. I usually say quite the handsome devil. Uh... Then I'll fight ever harder. Be ever stronger. Till my deeds eclipse my appearance. 
There you go. The people will see he's he's an optimist, if nothing else. Maybe even a beast hungry for their souls. But I will slay their monsters. So is Will technically a safe. tiefling now, and or is he just like a weird hybrid? The Blade of Frontiers again. Epic. I like the eye. It's cool. Oh, let me bring this up. Anger. I understand. Oh, uh, it's a little bit We've okay. We've preyed on by elithids, suffered insertion of a mind-bending worm. Bloodthirst is another matter, but perhaps not too big of one. If it's a devil or demon's flesh you're wanting to tear. Hmm. Seems unusual to me. Then again, we're talking about tadpoles <laughs> inserted into our brains by rubber. I'm not really. Uh, I don't. I'm not There's an expert on this. Nothing about it. All the more reason to stick close. I think you'll agree. Are you sure? All right. The blade stand, and just when things were warming up. We'll come back for you, Will. Don't worry about it. Speak. Uh, a tree. It is done. All right. Yeah, we got to level her up. We got to level up, Lazel. We also have to dye her armor green. Go ahead. I'm listening. If we're going to be part of the green team, you know. Your enterprising approach to my problem is most encouraging. But it is a delicate process to keep my condition stable. I do not yet need to consume an item. I, I just realized it's like everybody in my group is basically wearing camo. Much longer. Like we're training to be a part of like some elite assassination group or something, you know? We all have those from time to time. I once wished a most impure demise on a colleague of mine. I love how everybody is cool whenever I say, I feel the bloodlust inside of me. I wish to rip flesh from bone and devour it whole. And everybody's like, ah, you know, we all been there. We've all felt that from time to time. <laughs> We've all wanted to suck the marrow out of a <laughs> out of someone before. No, Happens to the best of us. Of if, if it is, they've forgotten to write it down in any text I've read on the subject. I mean, it is quite then relatable. Again, our yeah. case isn't exactly usual. Perhaps whatever's causing the bark urge demands the sap of who mans. If ceremorphosis takes place, all trace of your former self will be subsumed into the mind flayer's eye. Ooh, subsumed. So, to still be here, if I might forgetful. Still a win in my book. Okay. Uh, let's see. Maybe I shouldn't bring Alfier on this. Maybe I should bring Gale. Yeah, let's try to do that. I'm trying to have a healthy balance here. I'm trying to use at least uh, everybody in my party to a certain extent. What's up for discussion? Hi, Alfier. This vessel is at thine disposal. Do what thou wilt. Alfira, don't talk like that, please. W Withers, can you like, can you can you like tweak the personality a bit? I d I didn't know Alfira for long, but this is a little awkward. Yeah, why are you talking like that? This soul remembers its invective, but remembers not its tongue. Though spoken with a different voice, you recognize the eloquent drawl of Withers, the wraith that summoned the hireling. Withers. They are but echoes. They recall not a manner of speech. Thus, I lent them my rhetoric. Aha. Uh -huh. To speak thusly takes little of my effort. Besides, what better use is there of time than discourse? Uh, we could play Scrabble. I like Scrabble. <laughs> I love the little smirks that Bark Urge makes every now and then. This vessel is at thine disposal. Do art thou certain? Wait, wait. Wait, can I... Wait, can I make them leave the party? Or am I killing them? <laughs> like, am I, like... Wait, I gotta, I gotta know something here. Like, am I just kicking them out of the party for temporary sake? Or can I get them back later? Or is this just banishing them to the freaking black hole or something? The urge is bark. 
Goodbye. Go back to the fugue plane. It is temporary. All right, I'd like a second opinion on that. <laughs> I don't want to go through all that character creation again. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right. Uh, a yes. Single mortal soul, tossed as the errant. I, I'm not tossing. I'm just. So I'm just shall. asking you to stay at my camp. Oh, oh my God, Withers! I just wanted him to, to her to stay at my camp for like a couple hours while I go out with Gale. You you didn't have to banish her soul to a different dimension. That's a little that's a little excessive. Go ahead. I'm listening. Oh, Gale. Yeah, come on, buddy. With pleasure. Lead on. All right. Now. Uh, let's see. Who has the dye? That's orange dye. I don't want orange dye. We only have green dye in this camp. Oh, uh, yeah, we got pale green dye. All right, here we go. No, 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 not the bark urge, Lizelle. Okay, here we go. All right, here we are. Combine! Yes! Aha! Yes. She is becoming... Uh, it's not It's not as green as I thought it would be, but it, it good enough. All right, level up, Lizelle. Okay, we got Action Surge. The ultimate fighter ability. Ah, yes, we got Superiority Dies. The ultimate fighter ability. Ah, yes, the maneuvers. Uh, let's see. What kind of maneuvers are we feeling, guys? Let's see. What's a good one? What's the one that... Uh, okay, Duros always did trip attack or goading attack. Hmm. Pushing attack might be fun. Uh, ooh, repost. Trip's good. Evasive. What's the worst maneuver? Like, what's the one that no one ever takes? You can spend a superiority die to add the result to your attack roll. Pushing attack. You could disarm enemies and steal their weapons. Ooh. That's not a bad idea. I like that. You can disarm enemies, steal their weapons. Uh, precision attack is good, too. You can spend a superior to add to the result of your attack roll. That's not bad. All right. Yeah. I like this. Let's go with this. All right, then. Nice. Okay. I think we're good. Carlac just has... Oh, no. Carlac's outfit needs to be green, too. Everybody's got to have green outfits. We are part of a band. Yeah! That's a little bit more blue, but we'll find a dye. We'll find better dyes as we go. But that's what we got for right now. All right. Tell me, Lazo, when you say we might be purified at your crash... What does that mean? Oh, that's right. We're still here. Augusto will affix the Zaphisk, the purifier, to our heads. Ooh. Okay. His magic will quell the parasite in an instant. I see. So, hey, we've got this soul coin, right? Oh, yeah. I gave it to the thing you. Is, I think I can use it. My engine can, anyway. The so Moss I Mob. I love that. Again, we're the, we're not the green team. We're the Moss the Mob. I love that. Sort of. Next time we find ourselves toe to toe with something we want to squash. I like green so team or Moss Mob. Which one do we like? Hold on. I'm going to open a poll up. Start a poll. Team name. We got green team. We got Moss Mob. Is there any other good one? Anybody else have a good uh, good team name for us? I want to have a third option. We got Moss Mob. We got Green Team. We got. Uh, let's see, give it give it a second here. The Bark Band. Oh, that's good. The Bark Band. All right, all right. And we got one more. We have an option for one more. The Verdant Striders or Team Tree. I like that. I like that. All right, start pull. Team name! Let's go! 
Fuck yes. Damn, Carlac! Oh, I know you're excited about the team name! Oh, we're a great team. Alright. Never wanted the easy path. Did we get that sword from the leader of that group? Oh, that's right, that uh ladder burned down or it got attacked or destroyed or something. I think we did steal the Sword of Justice from Anders. Anders is still hanging out here. We took everything off this guy, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Okay, uh, alright. I think we're gonna head back to the Blighted Village. To the Blighted Village! Tell me, Lazel, what is it like on the Astral Plane? Your home realm intrigues me. Alright. Chalk. I will only be welcomed once I obtain a mind flayer. Alright, so there are some interesting uh, people we could fight here. If we could kill this guy, well, there's a couple things we could do with these guys, alright? So these guys are orcs, I think, that have one of the orcs has a uh, magic item that's a crown. That gives him intelligence of 17. So if any of us put on the crown, our in, our intelligence score immediately goes to 17. Uh, now, it can't go any higher than that. It's just set at 17. But we could definitely use that. <laughs> we could definitely use that. Uh, Gale's intelligence is obviously really good because he's a wizard. So his intelligence is 17. Uh, we can make Lazo. We can make anybody smart. And, wow, we don't have a... Wow! Gale is really carrying this the, the moss mob right now. <laughs> yeah. They're ogres, not orcs. There it is. Thank you. They are ogres, Tekking, not orcs. I'm an ogre. All right, smart bark. We could be smart bark. All right. So here's the thing, though. If we fight them now and, and take it from him, uh, they won't be able to help us later. We can kind of talk to them in my second playthrough. I kind of convinced them to help us and, like, hire them. Um, but I ended up fighting them anyway because basically I lied about how much money I have. Like, they were like, oh, okay, we were hired by, you know, the group at the goblin camp. But if you pay us more, we'll work for you. And I basically lied to them and said, okay... But I basically, like, rain check, though. Like, I have the money. I just don't have it on me right now. Like, how about this? You guys help me out whenever I need to. And then, you know, I'll pay you then. And so at the goblin camp, I used them to help me defeat all the goblins. And they they helped me out. But uh, I, I didn't pay them and I had to fight them. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We could just murder Hobo. Yeah. Yeah, you can recruit them. Well, okay, here's the thing, though. So I recruited them. I, I ha had them help me out. I had to end up fighting them anyway. But I reduced his HP down to a certain point, and he retreated. All right? I think he, he left. He got away. Because he's, like, not... He's smart enough to know he doesn't want to die. So I killed his two flunkies, his two, like, dumbass uh, friends. And then the one that actually has the crown or the, the, the helmet left. Go get more money and pay them. Yeah, no, I'm not doing that. So, what? what's the, uh, first of all, Moss Mob seems to have won the poll. Uh, Bark Band is a close second, though, so I'm gonna end that poll. So we are officially the Moss Mob. But, uh, the Ogre situation. <laughs> oh, that's a, that's a q and A. I could do a and a though. Uh, poll. I wanna do a poll. Okay. The Ogre situation. All right, what are we going to try to do here? Are we going to try to hire them or kill them? <laughs> what what are we doing here? And if we kill them, we could get a sweet magic item. We also got a uh, in the meantime, I'm just going to talk to this goblin. If you want to keep your insides on the inside, don't cause any trouble. What what is that uh okay. Huh. And then down here in this well, there's also a spider cave we could go into. No traps, pick up please. some, pick up some fish. We need some more food. Ah, the bark urge desires fish. All of the fish. Ah, yes, fish and another fish. Two types of fish that are the same fish. I am a tree. For all I know is fish. Rags.
I do not desire rags. Uh, kill them seems to be the upper limit here. Yes, I know. Well, I tried to do that last time, and he ended up running away. So we'll see how this goes. Well, it really comes down to... Okay. It really comes down to my rules here. Because last time I saved scum like a motherfucker. We're not doing that this time. No chicken. Ow! Slugfish. Hello there, kind Gentlemen. gentleman. Contain yourselves. This quarrel sells our feast. Besides, tastes like pork. I just had some pork. I made some awesome lasagna tonight. It was incredible. Greetings, large Brothers, one. I am the no Bark idea. Urge. I have Did he just finger gun price. us? Hey, how you to doing? Our our bellies. Stranger. Be you friend or food. The mark is her measure. Show is the brand of the absolute. Okay, I got that. I got that. Ah, oh, yeah. Dom. Indeed. How regrettable that your meat must go on sale. I will take that as I I am not made of meat. I am a hundred percent vegetarian, sir. Not food. Friends. Friends, not food. That was on purpose. That was from that was from Finding Nemo, and everybody knows it. I've no use for the absolute or any god. I follow two masters only: gluttony and greed. Oh, I'll definitely eat meat. I just happen to be made of plant. I'm a reverse vegetarian. <laughs> I'm a reverse vegetarian. I'm made of vegetarian, but I eat meat. Goblin give gold. We check brand. Good deal. Huh, okay. No talk. Bonk. Am I not astonishing? <laughs> okay. A robust diet makes for a shrewd mind, you see. I am a gourmand, and you. A delicacy. Were I so lucky? Hmm. I am, by all accounts, a student of higher commerce and extortion. He knows a lot of big Make words. Me an offer. It's magic. Tempt me. All right. So last time I was able to deceive him with the money. Uh, I guess I could try. I am a very, I am the persuasive tree. I love Carlac back there looking very polite. Oh boy. All right. All right. Time to see just how persuasive this persuasive tree is. Watch. It's going to be a one. You know, it's going to be a one, right? I knew it. Ah! I'm not even going to use inspiration for this. I can see where the wind is going on this one. A slip of the tongue. <laughs> you meant to make a better offer, surely. Yes, I did. My offer is attack! Dinner time, boys. All right, let's rock and roll! Oh, he's casting blur. All right. Here we go! Ah, oh, that did a lot of damage. <laughs> okay, you guys are big. Okay, that guy's moving over there for some reason, Frank. All right, we got Frank, we got Chuck, and we got Luth, uh, Lump, Lump, yeah, Lump. Okay, all right. Who's up first? Lazel with her badass fire sword. Let's go, everybody. Uh, what do we got? We got Cleave. We got Pummel Strike. We got Lacerate. Uh, lacerate seems fun. Let's do that. Lacerate! Yeah! Okay. Uh, let's see. 
Superiority die. I could use that. All right, let's do that. Nice. And let's action surge because why not? All right, cleave. Yeah. All right. Okay. And a pummel strike. Why not? Oh yeah. All right, cool. All right, awesome. Good job, Lazel. All right, Carlac. Let's rock and roll. The bear! Moving. Okay. Reckless attack! All right, I think I only have the one reckless attack so far. Still on my feet. All right, I have to figure out a way to get around here. Too bad I can't turn into a bird. All right. I got a wild shape here. It's not going to be good. All right. Wolf. Cat. Badger. We got to take this guy down. Let's see. Uh, let's go wolf. Woo! All right. Uh, how much HP do I have as a wolf? 18. All right. I'll get an opportunity attack here, but uh, it's fine. I got to get around him. Okay. There we go. All right. I think that's all I could do on my turn. All right, Gale. Now, we're going to do some Misty Step shenanigans here. Can you get up here? Nice! Cool. All right. Ooh, Ray of Enfeeblement. They deal half damage with weapon attacks. That might not be a bad idea. Ha-ha! <laughs> He's enfeebled, you fool! All right. Oh, the goblin is also dealing... Oh, okay. Well, I don't think that's going to be... We don't have to really worry about that guy. He only has, like... like okay. Oh, come on! I didn't know he could do that! All right. All right, here we go. see here. Unrelenting Ferocity. That does some healing. Uh, to deal an additional three slashing damage with your melee weapon. This one. I will go with that. I will do that. Actually, no. Lacerate. Lacerate's better. Damn it. Alright. Uh, I don't think there's anything else I can do on Karlak's turn. Ooh, disarming attack. Let's try that out now. Oh, damn. That did some damage. All right. He's so smart. He's doing things. What are, where are you going, Frank? I go down to help. All right. Oh, yeah! Got a crit. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Heal up. I didn't fancy that, All right, Gale. Uh, yeah, kind of right in the middle of this bullshit. Okay, um... Let's see. Blindness would be fun. Let's, let's get out of here first. He didn't take as much damage as I thought he would. Ah, oh, man, here comes another one. All right. Burning hands. I can use... Uh, Ray of Frost. That'll reduce his movement. Uh, 49. Uh. Magic missile's a guarantee. I think we do that. Not much, but it's a guarantee. And it broke his concentration. I'll fucking take it. Yeah. All right. Okay, I got knocked out of wolf mode. All right. Okay, Carlac. Reckless attack. Let's go. All right. One of them's down. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Move on up. Yeah, I know. Whatever. Okay. Uh, she's 
I'll have her take a potion, but I think she would be alright. Yeah, this guy's- I'm not worried. I have to kill this guy. This is the whole point of this. Yeah! Come on! Let's go, Lazelle! I knew putting you in the party was the right way to go, girl. Woo! She's not even hit yet. Alright. Use tree lightning. I think it might be time to bust out tree lightning. Breck. I be Broler Beck! Breck, not Beck. I'm thinking of Ben Beckman. I Frank. I don't know. Where the fuck is this guy going? Frank, come on, buddy. I know you don't got shit for intelligence, but come on. All right, we need to do some damage here. We might be able to kill him this turn. All right, uh... Let's see what we got here. I could try using Hold Person. Must be humanoid. Oh, he's humanoid. He's got two arms, two legs. His eyes, nose, mouth, and ears are all in the same place as yours. How is this guy not humanoid? If by One Piece standards, this guy is humanoid. All right. Bazel. Um... Yeah, bark skin might not be bad. Moonbeam might be the way to go, though. Yeah, or blindness. Can I blind him? 50% chance of blindness happening. Uh, Moonbeam. 100% chance. He has to make a save, I think, though. Uh, yeah. So, he'll take half damage, but he'll take something. So... Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, I think I think I'll just do Moonbeam. Okay, yeah, no, that was the way to go there. That was the way to go. And uh take some more refreshing Gatorade. Alright, Gale. I think Gale might be able to finish him off here. Eight HP. Oh, I think a magic missile might do it. Yeah, okay, good. We're going to get that helmet. We got it. We got that helmet. We just have to kill Frank up here, and we're fine. I don't think that'll be much of a big deal. All right. Oh, we got to kill some of these. Oh, no. All right, well. You have made the wrong move this day, unnamed goblin. <laughs> this guy has a name. This dude was just unnamed goblin brawler. Yeah. All right, dead. No! Lump! All right, that was the first attack Lazelle actually took. All right. Warped headband of intellect. Equip! I'll take this scroll of blur. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'll be able to use this anymore, but I can sell it. Okay, oh, I want to read his diary. I want to read his diary so much. All right, I used my action to put on the, the crown, so I can't do much else. But I can move the moon. Oh, I can't even... Can I move the moonbeam? I don't think I could use it. Yeah, I can't. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. I could get a one spell slot back with arcane cultivation, but blindness is level two. Misty steps level two, so that's not going to help. His name was Brawler the Goblin. That's fair. Uh, I think we just use another magic missile. All right. All right. Ah! Now we just have to finish this guy off. Oh, this is. You're gonna be the tough one, aren't you? It's actually Frank. Frank was actually the toughest one. Okay. I can move this moonbeam. So that's interesting. I didn't know I could do that, but now I do. Feel the spores of my tree kind. All right. Try Witch Bolt. We are definitely leveling up after this. There it is. Oh, one more. Lazelle, you want to deal the finishing blow, girl? No, I guess not, but it's okay. 
And the moonbeam does it. Woo! I can't believe we survived that. Whoa, I'm actually really surprised we survived that. All right, everybody, short rest all around. Oh, that put the wind back in my sails. Oh, boy. All right, Chonk, you got anything, Chuck? Chuck doesn't. They don't have shit. All right. Wait, we're still not leveled up from that. Jeez, come on. I want to read Lunk's diary. Oh, I got the Deathstalker mantle. When you kill an enemy, shroud yourself in primeval dark. Oh, that's the thing I'm wearing. Oh, that's my cloak. Yes. That is, of course, mine. It looks nice, but it's just not green enough, you know? You know what I mean? Just not green enough. Okay, hold on a second. That is not green. Pale green, my ass. I'm never buying from that store again. That is not green. That is cyan blue. Man, these cheap-ass green dyes. I need to go back and buy some more dye from that guy in the from AA Ron back at the uh, back at the Grove. Okay. Um, I'm trying to think here. What do I need? Uh, that. Oh yeah. The uh, let's make myself a smart tree. Let's do that right now. I am no longer your average run-of-the-mill tree. I am- I already have it on. I am the smart tree. I am smart tree! I am an erudite tree. Okay. Now that I see the truth, I could scarcely remember a time before. At first it the human's thin flesh and bestowed this gift, but I've come to believe it was the circlet she wore. There was crunch in that shoe. That's nice. Okay. I'm going to head back to the grove real quick after I save. Talk. Light on my feet. We'll, we'll try to get to Anti-Ethel this time. I'll try to. We, we Actually, there are some battles. There are a, I think there is a fight on the way there. As is your battle stance itself. I might switch out uh, Gale, though, because I, I burned a lot of spell slots there. I think I'm going to switch out Gale for Shadowheart. Or maybe Will. Maybe Will. We could have Will now. Thank you. I prefer Abjuration over Acrobatics. Abjuration Acrobatics. That seems like a fun thing you could do at, like, the gym on Sundays. Like the YPC, like the YMCA or something, you know? I am Smart Tree. Hey, A-R-R-Ron. -R -R Need anything else? Yeah, I do actually. Do you have Always any more? Happy to help those who follow the first do you have any more dyes? Yellow, no. Purple, no. Ocean, no. Dye remover. That actually might come in handy. I'll take some of that. Um, how much money do I have? Two hundred forty-three. God, I bought all the good dyes. Orange, yellow. What do we look like? A uh, a sun team or a team of of canaries? Missile snaring. You can intercept attacks. Rain dancer. Ooh, yeah, that's that might be fun for Gale. Give him a fancy new because because he's just got the standard quarter staff right now, right? Yeah. Rain dancer might not be bad for him. Okay. Dragon's grasp might be good for Carlac. Give her a nice axe. There we go. The Ring of Flinging. That'll be cool. I hope the DLC is water deep. Yeah, that'd be cool to see Gale's hometown. He actually, if you romance Gale, he does use a spell to like like send like you go to visit his uh keep in Waterdeep. It's it's just an illusion, but you get to see what his house is like. You spent a very romantic evening together. Pale green dye, that is exactly what I needed. Thank you, sir. Oh wait, no, that's the same dye we have now, isn't it? Is that the same shit we have? Ah, damn it, no. We need real good dye, man. Not this pale green shit. Oh, we do have a funny little hat though. Give me that funny little hat. 
Oh, I'm insufficient gold. Am I out of money already? Oh, man. All right, okay, we got to trade some crap. Um, let's see. I will trade you this diary uh, and this moonstone. Uh, let's see. This horn that I'm not going to be able to use now because I killed the guy that was going to be able to use it. Uh, let's see. What else do we got here? Uh, you can take this random quarterstaff. I kind of need my armor. I'm going to keep that. You can keep this. Scale mail. Moondrop pendant. I'm kind of saving that for when Gale has his urge. Scroll of shocking grasp. Do I really need that? Not really. Uh, I'll, t I'll keep this scroll of blur. That's pretty good. Got scammed again. I love how Lazel has a Kanabo. Salutations. Yeah. All right. So, what was I gonna buy here? Um, I was gonna buy. Oh, oh, oh! You know, I need some more potions. Not be a bad idea to have some more potions. Yeah, spread them out amongst the party. Okay. Anything else? A pitcher of beer. Scroll of Revivify. I, that's too much money. I think this is good. I think we're all right. Yeah. Okay. Sylvanas be with you. I was going to buy the funny hat. Oh, that's right. Yes. Yeah. Need anything else? Yes, I need one funny Always hat, happy please. To help those who follow the first circle. Give me your finest funny hat. Did I already buy the funny hat? Oh, no, there it is. Th thank you for the funny hat. All right. All right. Now, uh, let's split this. Okay, who does not have any potions? Carlac doesn't have any. I'll give three to her. Gail actually probably needs the most. I'll give, because Carlac has a lot of HP. So, Gale has three. Lazelle has one. That's probably all right for her. I'm the main character, so I get the most. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Uh, okay, the funny hat. Yes. Gale, wear this funny hat, please. I will find it hilarious. Okay, there we go. And I guess we'll dye it. Eh, close enough. Ahead. All right. All right. So back to the village. Oh, I was gonna go to camp. <sighs> Smell that fresh forest. Back to camp. All right. Uh, At the ready. I'm gonna kick Gale out because he's out of spells. I think I, I wore through a lot of spells with that fight. Go ahead. I'm listening. That hat suits you like awesome, like a million bucks, Gale. I question the wisdom. I'll be here. And let's recruit Will. Well met. A possibility, but I don't have a clue where to start, other than there could well be. She has the blighted thing. My con. The only way out is if I can. That without the pack. That's great. I'd like you to join me. Okay, great. Thank you. All right, everybody, good to go. Nice. Oh, the clear area. I think that's a new condition. I, I never remembered seeing that when I played this the first time. Okay, leave camp. Less people watching than I thought. Um, the first episode always does the best with these let's with these like let's plays. Almost always. Uh, but the views overall have been steady around ten, fifteen thousand. All right. Uh, Anti Ethel is down here. That's Korga by the swamp. Yeah, so we're heading. We're heading in the right direction. Okay. All right. We're we're about a uh, an hour into the stream. Actually, almost an hour exactly. But we're on the right path here. We're on the right path, heading toward Anti Ethel's house. Guys, we're just going to our auntie's house. Remember our Anti Ethel? I remember our Anti Ethel. She used to always give us Swedish fish back in the day. Ah, oh, there she is now. For the love of all that is holy, I've never clapped eyes on your poor sister. I trust her. Drop the act, hag. Hey! You was the last to see Marina. That's rude, and Marina is a stupid name. Thank goodness you're here, sweetie. I, I don't know what's come over these boys. Let me end this poll here. We won't ask again. 
Well, I am a rather intelligent tree. I love how I look like it's a circlet, but it looks like I just stabbed it right into my head. You know, that's that's how the circlet works. I just took out a screw and just drilled it right into my head. Yeah. Careful. Don't trust a word out of her mouth. Our sister went to the hag, and we ain't seen her since. Well, that's... Hand over harsh. I don't know this. I, I don't see the connection. I gladly help you all look for her, though. She is clearly Enough. covered in blood. Where is she? Bollocks. <gasps> Bollocks? We're supposed to rush to my defense. You never Lord. talked like that. A lot of good you are. Some advice. You ever darken my door, you'd best have that head bowed and an apology at the ready. Bye bye now. Uh oh. Nothing she else. could teleport? She just disappeared. I ain't seen nothing like that before. She could shoot fireworks. I have. Backside for all for I, I am intelligent. I am the thinking tree. Thank you very much. It's our sister, Marina. She's. Well. She was in a bad way after her husband died. Started saying weird things, like how she was gonna bring him back. Next thing, she's gone looking for the hag. Bring him of bark? All the stupid hmm. things to do. Possible. We haven't seen her since. And no good ever came from dealing with a hag. None of this matters, all right? We need to get her back and fast. All right. I'll do it. Are you joking? What? No. A I'm a tree. I don't no joke. Way I'm leaving Rena to you. But, Joel. Not all right. Chance. We're getting her back on our own. Now, come on. So, you don't want me to help at all? All right. Seems a little bit counterintuitive. You know, I am a thinking tree, and I feel bad for your plight. So, I will come with you. Actually, no, I'm going to go this way. You have fun. This this looks like there might be something over here. Oh. Ooh, there's a carrot. I knew it. Mugwort. And a potato. I, lo I am the potato tree. Let us go. Ooh. A chill runs up your spine. You feel like you're being watched. Hmm. Well, I am a thinking tree. Ooh, is investigation an intelligence role? Because if so, I'm totally doing that. Yeah, we got to save Halson at some point. We got to romance. I think I'm going to romance Halson this time around. Yes. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it, ladies and gentlemen. Minus one to intelligence. I am the thinking tree. I am the thinking tree. All right. Let's do that again. I feel like I could do better this time. All right. Here we go. All right. That's better. That's really what I wanted to see. Okay. I am smart. S M R T. I mean S M A R T. You blink and the wilderness changes. Wait a the minute. This isn't a this isn't a forest. This is a swamp or possibly a bog or possibly a mire. Not sure which. Ugh. You know, my grandfather, my grandpappy was born in a swamp. Ooh, what are these fine-looking gentlemen? This will be fun. Hello there, sir. How are you today? I love your red hat. Oh, wait, no! Holy shit, I forgot something. Will's outfit. It's not green enough. We gotta fix that at once. Will, you're not part of the Moss Mob. That is not part of the Moss Mob, but I'll have to it'll have to do, damn it. It'll have to do until we get some proper green dye. Heading out. At least things have stayed interesting. The murderous glare of a red cap. A fey creature known for its bloodlust greets you. I know that because I am the thinking tree. That noise. Is the creature pretending to be a sheep? Yeah, you'd think if it was a swamp, they'd pretend to be a frog or something. 
You seize me? Indeed. For no, I am intelligent. I'm sucking lust with little hey, hey! Lips. I don't have hair to have lice. Now, scum... Scum is a great source of nutrients. I'm okay with that. I'm not going anywhere, sir. I am visiting my grandpappy who lives in this swamp and maybe also stop by to see Auntie Ethel and kill her or whatever's going on with her with this plotline. Look, I'm sorry, man, but we got to get to level four and you guys, uh, you guys are all sitting here waiting. So here we go. I love how we have all, all surrounded this guy. All right, who's up first, Carlac? All right, let's rock and rage. Roar! Yeah. Okay. Time to strike. I'm not gonna burn out all of the cool stuff with this one guy, but I will do this. All right, that's all I need. Man, that ever burn blade really does its uh, weight sometimes. All right, I will do a pummel strike. There it is. Ooh. That did a decent amount of damage there, actually. Holy shit. Oh, that's not good. These damn red caps. All right, who's up next? Will? All right, we got to break this guy's concentration here. Uh, that's disadvantage. I could use Misty. Oh, yeah, that's right. He has Misty steps. So that's good. Will, go deal with that guy. Go deal with that guy, please. Ah, I saved. All right. All right. Uh, we got to take care of a couple of things here. Hmm. What's our range on Moonbeam? He is just out. Oh, can I hit him? I can! But yeah, concentration broken. Perfect. Great. Thank you. All right. That's exactly what I needed. Now, I think I can move away without provoking opportunity attack, which I will do. There we go. All right. Okay. There's... All right. Rah! All right, Carlac. Are you still raging? Good. She's still raging even after hold person. Okay. We got to kill this red cap. Ugh. Man. These guys are tough. I guess I will have to bust out something on them. I don't want to bust out, uh, bust out that. We'll do... Uh, well, how many superiority die do we have? I will I will drop a potion, though. All right. Uh, does it say how many superiority dies we have left? Oh, yeah, right here. We have four. Okay, good. So, we go. Oh, we get them back during a short rest. That's great. That's fantastic. All right. Let's try this, then. Yeah, that 30% of that had a chance to work, and it did work. Damn. Okay, nice. You can't open Will's wounds. He's already he's already sad. Okay, that guy's dead. Keep on Eldritch blasting. When in doubt, blast him. All right. We're not doing too bad here. We're not doing too shabby. Yeah, right into the moonbeam. Oh, come on. You hit my moonbeam. Asshole. Just for that, you got to deal with the badger. Can't slow down. I can't slow down for I am a badger. All right, he's going to multi-attack. Hellish rebuke. Nice. All right, we're dealing a decent amount of damage here for these guys. Can we kill this fucker already? Oh, my God. We're having so much trouble with this one dick over here. All right, we killed him. Great. Fantastic. Okay. Now, Will, he's hurting. Pop a potion. This should maybe do something. All right, knock him back. All right. Lysel, no! All right. With haste. Badgers can't bleed. Yeah! All 
Just gotta go all Danny DeVito with it. Will down! Will down! Alright, uh... Ooh, I have that potion of flinging. Or that ring of flinging. Could I do a throw? Can I can I pick up this red cap's body and chuck him at the other red cap? I can, but I have to. It's I can't throw him all the way there, but I could do this. I could do that next turn. All right, here we go. Oh. It doesn't hit, I mean, it doesn't hit at a distance when it doesn't have disadvantage, but I hit twice with it when it's up close and does have disadvantage. Okay, sure. You know what? I'm going to short rest after this anyway and get another action surge back. Uh, so, yeah, let's just do that. Oh, come on! Uh Okay. Oh, that's not Oh, that's not good. All right. Death save. Uh this isn't looking hot for me. I will ascend. All right, we got some second wind action going. Trip attack, trip attack, melee. Taste my fury. All right. Lazel might have to carry this. All right. Death save. You will not take me. Unrelenting frenzy. Okay. Can't do anything else this turn. I could disengage. Or I guess I can't. No, that was my action. Yeah! yeah! Oh, still moving. I'll, you know what? I'll take that. Uh, Death sake successful. We're not dead. We're, we're not dead yet. Lazel, no! Oh, man. This is tough. All right. We can kill this one. Oh, come on! 4 HP! Okay. Saved. Good. Good. All right. All right. Okay. All right, Karlak, can you kill this thing, please? Jeez. Okay, finally. All right. Karlak might be the one to save the freaking day here. Karlak might be the one to save the day. All right. Holy shit. Might need to reset. Well, I'll die. I'll reset when I die. Oh, thank God. All right. Time to get up, Will. Time to smack your ass. Get up. All right. Okay. 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 Taking position. I'm out of superiority die, but I'm not out of options. Yeah, hamstrung. Okay, cool. Get a potion in you, Will. All right, that's fine. Okay. Oh, I've had enough of your bullshit today. I wish I could pick up Will and throw him. 
Nah, probably not a good idea. Yeah, gaping wombs and hamstrung. How did I do that? Woo! All right. Damn, it's good to be alive. Oh, that was a close one. All right, everybody, get up. No time for that. Time to get up, everybody. Holy crap. Ugh. Karlak leveled up. She deserved that. Karlak deserves all the loot from that one. Short rest, everybody. Woo! Oh, wait, are those apples poisoned? I feel like those apples might be poisoned. Yeah, those apples are poisoned. Well, actually, hold on. You never know when you're going to need a poisoned apple. You never know when you'll need a poisoned apple. Let's send them to camp. Oh, I should have dropped a soul coin there. That would have been perfect. Oh, no, Demir. Demir. Demir's dead. Guys, Demir's dead. Oh, he has a cleaver. That's cool. All right, I'll, I'll remember him with his cleaver. Uh, now, do we investigate the Korga thing, or do we go... Well, the tea house is right here. Never a dull moment. All right, what do we got? Change bestial heart. Nice. Feet. Ooh, okay, what feet are we going with here? Uh huh. Got some options. Oh, or can I just take an AC increase? New feet available. Oh, ability improvement. There it is. Uh, what are we doing with Carlac? What is a good What is a good feat for Carlac? Yeah, it's a feat. They're pronounced the same way. At least that's the way I've been pronouncing it my whole life. Is it a, is it a, is feet and feet different pronunciations? Because I'm just finding that out. Great weapon master. Yeah, that is a good one. If you're using a two-handed weapon. Well, I don't think I'm using a two-handed weapon right now, but I'm definitely going to get that. Uh, she has a two-handed great axe, so there you go. Because this axe is not two-handed. I think it's just a light axe. Yeah, it's Dragon's Grasp. Oh, I could throw the axe. That's good to know. All right. All right. Okay. All's well that ends. Well, not as bad as it could have. Not as bad as it could have. Wonder if the gods are watching me. All right, ever oh, they're certainly not the tree gods, maybe, but the regular gods—they gave up us on us on a, a lot a while ago. Yeah, I was gonna say feet and feet should be homonyms. My favorite one is pitcher, because pitcher can be like a pitcher of water, a pitcher like a baseball pitcher. Yeah. Ooh, is that a spider? Oh, that's a dead crow. All right. Let's go see our, our aunt. Oh, look. See, she looks like... She's having a good time. Wait, you're going to kick out the pie? The pie is awesome. I love pie. for two, so get to it. If it isn't the cheekiest pop of them all, you best have one hells of an apology for me, young man. Ma'am, I am sorry. For I am a tree, and you will get no apology from me. I now am the enlightened tree. I know of what you are. Ha! I do like the mouthy ones. You know, I was going to give you a swift kick up the arse and show you the door. But I think you and I could have a bit of fun together. Gods grant me patience. Eat up, Marina. 
I won't say it again. Hmm. Both of you are wearing green. However, the young lady is wearing a darker shade of green. So I trust her more. Keep that hole under your nose shut. Or things will get messy. Hmm. Spill it. Mayrina deserves the truth. What is it? What's going on? That can't be true. I love how Lazel disapproved so. of us saying they that. Were being rude, and I detest rudeness. You monster! The deal is off. Enough. Away, would you? Wait, what? Oh. Oh, but now she can... Yes, Wait a minute, she can use green magic? Oh, this changes things. Good. And you, you'll regret sticking your nose in my business. This is making things difficult. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, you're using green magic. That's so cool. Shit. You're so green. Oh, my goodness. You. You. You're the most beautiful woman I've ever seen in my life. I don't want to do this, please. You're so green. Coming through. Will make it quick. Arms of Hardar. Hardar, Hadar, Hadar. All right. Uh, what do we got here? Uh. Deals an additional one d six necrotic damage per level. All right, I don't think that'll work on... I think you have to be able to see her. Okay. Armor of Agathis. Let's let's do that, sure. All right. Not me, the Bark Urge. I wonder if this is worth the cost. All right, we need some kind of, like, um... Some type of, uh... They'll catch a break. Like, area of effect kind of kind of thing. Some kind of attack that could deal damage to a large area at once. Uh, something that can, you know, do do that. Uh, what, what do we got in our repertoire here? Uh, did we have spike growth? Do we not have spike growth anymore? I thought that was the thing we had because we were wizards. Entangle. I mean, because we were druid. We have thorn whip. We have bone chill cheese through the enemy. Alright. Hmm. You know... Oh, I could do Entangle. Ha-ha! Alright, so she's right there. Nice to know. I know the general location. All right, Lizelle. Let's see what we got here. Hmm. I don't think you can reach her yet. Count on me. No, 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 no. This is like the first phase of this fight, and it's not really, you know. So I don't want to waste anything yet, really. Not enough movement. I'll use it on Will. Aha! There you are. Oh! Okay. Bye bye, lovely. Look at you running away. I can't have gone far. Hold on a second. How do I end concentration of a spell here? Oh, we can't. Oh, oh man, we all got perfect amount of XP to level up. Great. Uh, let me see really quick here. I want to stop concentrating on this spell. Level up! Thanks, everybody. The dogs are barking. Can we rest? Oh, here it is. Here it is. Little button in the corner. Okay, level up time. 
All right, level four, finally. Jeez, level four, druid. Oh, we can wild shape into a deep wrath. I don't know what that is, but we can transform into it. And we get a new cantrip. We get produce flame. Oh, we could get guidance. I think I'm just going to go that. I think that has the most yield. All right. What's a good foot for a druid? For a tree? Are there any tree themed? Are there any tree themed? Oh, sentinel's good. When an enemy... Trees are very sentinel, after all. We could be a lucky tree. We could be a tough tree. We could be a resilient tree. We could be a mobile tree. See, that doesn't work. Trees aren't mobile. You know. Tough. Warlock tree. Yeah. Tough. I'm gonna go tough. We're a tough tree, damn it. I am the toughest damn tree you've ever did seen. All right. Uh, let's see. She has a 17 strength. Okay, Lazel, what do we got for you? I mean, Heavy Armor Master. Not Heavy Armor, a Great Weapon Master for you would probably work out okay, too. I think that's good. I think great, because she does have a two-handed... Um, yeah. Lazel does use the two hands, so I think we're good there. All right, Will, let's see what we got here. Oh, yeah, True Strike, that's useful. Friends, Mage Hand, Minor Illusion, Poison Spray. I mean, you already got Eldritch Blast. I don't think that... I mean, Eldritch Blast is the only... When you have that, do you really need any other cantrip? I'll go with Minor Illusion, actually. That might actually have some utility. All right, what do we got here? Scorching Ray seems like the good choice. Hold Person might not be bad, though. Yeah, we'll do hold person. And as for a feat, friends is good. All right, I'll take friends. Do 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 do. No one told me it was gonna be this way. Yeah, scorching ray kicks ass. All right, what else do we got here? Sentinel for Will. What's good for Will here? Warcaster. You gain advantage on saving throws to maintain concentration. Does he have a lot of spells that require concentration? I think he does. Moderately armored. We could just make we can make Will a heavy. We can make him work up. We can. I think we have to do medium armor proficiency. We should waste all the feats. Oh my god. All of it's locked out. Guys, guys, 